empowering your financial journey. Hey, savvy viewers. Welcome back to Money Matters, the place where we break down life's complexities into bite-sized, actionable tips. Today, we're diving into a topic that hits close to home for many of us, Money Matters. So, how many of you have ever felt like you're in a financial maze, trying to figure out which way to go? Or maybe you're wondering if you're the only one struggling to make those dollars stretch until the next payday? And seriously, who else has asked themselves, why didn't they teach us this stuff in school? Well, you're not alone. In this video, we're unlocking the secrets to financial success specifically tailored for millennials. We get it, the struggle is real when it comes to managing our hard-earned cash. But fear not. By the end of this video, you'll be armed with 5 essential financial tips that can turn your financial frown upside down. So, grab a seat, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, and let's navigate the financial jungle together. Number 1. Understanding your income. 1. Importance of knowing your income sources. Alright, let's kick things off with a financial game changer, understanding where your money comes from. Imagine you have a treasure chest, and inside it are all the coins you make. But here's the trick, you need to know where those coins are coming from. Whether it's your job, a side hustle, or maybe even a birthday card from grandma, every coin counts. Knowing your income sources is like having a map to your treasure, helping you see where your money is coming from and how much you've got to work with. 2. Budgeting Basics for Millennials now that we've found our treasure, it's time to talk about budgeting, the superhero cape of personal finance. Think of your budget as a plan for your money. We're not talking about complicated spreadsheets here, we're talking about a simple plan that tells your money where to go. How much for bills, how much for fun, and how much for saving that treasure we just talked about. Budgeting is like being the boss of your money, you get to decide where it goes. 3. Tracking expenses to identify spending patterns. Okay, let's get real, ever wonder where your money disappears to by the end of the month? Tracking your expenses is like being a detective on a money mystery mission. Write down every little thing you spend money on, snacks, games, that cool gadget you saw online, everything. It helps you see patterns. Are you spending too much on snacks? Or maybe those online impulse buys are adding up. Tracking expenses is your secret weapon to spotting spending habits and making smarter money moves. Remember, financial wizardry isn't about big words and complicated spells, it's about simple tricks that make your money work for you. Stay tuned because, in our next tip, we're talking about building a magical emergency fund. Number 2. Building an emergency fund. 1. Explanation of what an emergency fund is and its significance. Alright, let's talk about something super important, your emergency fund. Think of it as your superhero shield against unexpected surprises. An emergency fund is like a special savings account that's there to rescue you when things go a bit haywire. Car breaks down? Emergency fund to the rescue. Unexpected vet bill for your pet lizard? Emergency fund to the rescue again. It's your financial superhero cape when life throws curveballs. 2. Setting Realistic Goals for Emergency Fund Savings Now, let's be realistic superheroes. Saving money doesn't mean you have to eat noodles for every meal or skip movie nights. It's about setting achievable goals. Start small, maybe aim for saving a little bit each week or month. The key is consistency. Like planting seeds for a money garden, you want to watch your emergency fund grow over time. So. Put on your superhero cape and start saving a little for that just-in-case moment. 3. Tips for building and maintaining the emergency fund Building your emergency fund is like training for a marathon, it takes time and a bit of effort. 1. Tip, treat your emergency fund like a VIP guest. When you get some extra coins, send them its way. Another tip, make it a team effort. Get your friends or family involved you'll be surprised how fun it can be to save together. And the most important tip, don't touch it unless it's a real emergency. Your emergency fund is your financial superhero, let it do its job when you really need it. Stay tuned because, in our next financial adventure, we're going to tackle the dragon of student loans and debts. Number 3. 
Tackling Student Loans and Debt 1. The Impact of Student Loans on Financial Health All right, young money masters, let's talk about something that might sound a bit tricky, student loans. Imagine you're on an adventure to learn cool things, but there's a dragon called student loans blocking your path. These dragons can be pretty heavy on your shoulders, affecting your financial health. We want you to know that it's normal to have student loans, but we're here to share some magical spells to help you deal with them. 2. Strategies for Managing and Paying Off Student Loans Now, for the good stuff, how to conquer that dragon. First up, make friends with your student loan wizard. Understand how much you owe, who you owe it to, and when your payments are due. Knowledge is your sword in this battle. Next, consider paying a bit more when you can. It's like giving the dragon a little poke each month to weaken it faster. And if things get tough, don't be afraid to ask for help. There are wizards, ahem, loan counselors, who can guide you through the magical forest of student loans. 3. Dealing with other forms of debt and avoiding debt traps. But wait, there's more. Besides student loans, there are other sneaky creatures called debts that might try to tag along. Beware of credit card goblins and loan sharks, they promise quick rewards but can lead you into debt traps. Our advice? Only use magic or credit when you really need to, and always pay it back on time. It's like creating a shield to protect yourself from debt monsters. In our next chapter, we're unleashing the power of investing and showing you how to grow your treasure even more. Stay tuned, young wizards of finance. Number 4. Investing for the future. 1. The power of compounding and starting early. Welcome, future millionaires. Now that we've conquered some financial dragons, it's time to talk about growing your treasure even more. Ever heard of the magical spell called compounding? It's like planting a money tree, and the earlier you start, the bigger your tree grows. Let's say you save a little coin, and it grows. Then, the next year, it grows even more on top of what it grew last year, it's like magic. Starting early is like having a superpower, it gives your money more time to grow and become a mighty money tree. 2. Introduction to various investment options suitable for millennials. Now, let's explore the enchanted forest of investments. There are different ways to make your money work for you. Imagine you're choosing your adventure, you could go with stocks, bonds, or even a magical potion called mutual funds. Each has its own powers, and the key is finding the mix that fits your goals. Don't worry, you don't need a wizard hat for this, just a bit of knowledge and curiosity. 3. Risk Management and Diversification in Investment Portfolios But beware, young adventurers. Every adventure comes with a bit of risk. It's like exploring a mysterious cave, you want to be prepared. Diversification is your shield. Instead of putting all your treasure in one place, spread it out. If one part of your treasure map gets a little stormy, the other parts stay safe and sound. It's the secret sauce to protect your wealth and make your financial journey a bit smoother. Stay tuned because in our next episode, we're setting sail on the sea of retirement planning, your ultimate quest for financial freedom. Get ready, financial explorers. Number 5. Planning for Retirement 1. The Benefits of Starting Retirement Planning Early Ahoy, future captains of the financial seas! Now, let's set sail on the most exciting journey yet, retirement planning. Picture this, you're on a grand adventure, and you want to make sure you have a cozy cabin and plenty of treasure when the adventure winds down. Starting retirement planning early is like having a magical compass that guides you to a comfortable and worry-free retirement. The earlier you start, the more treasure you can stash away, and the smoother your sailing will be. 2. Overview of retirement savings options like 401k, IRAs, etc. So, how do you fill your treasure chest for retirement? There are these special tools called 401, K, S and IRAs, consider them like magical chests that multiply your coins over time. Your job might offer a 401k, where you can stash away some of your treasure before you even see it in your hands. IRAs are like personal treasure chests you can open, and you get to choose the magical investments inside. It's like building your own treasure vault with the help of these wizardly options. 
3. Balancing short-term financial goals with long-term retirement planning. But hold on, fellow adventurers. Balancing your treasure isn't just about thinking about retirement someday, it's about balancing the now and the later. Sure, you want to enjoy your favorite snacks and treats today, but you also want to make sure future you has a feast fit for a king. It's like having a map that shows both the next exciting stop and the ultimate destination. Finding the right balance makes your journey more enjoyable and ensures you have enough treasure for all the chapters of your life. In our grand finale, we'll wrap up our financial adventure with a recap of these magical money lessons and set the stage for more financial wisdom. Stay tuned, financial explorers, for the grand finale of our Money Mastery series. And there you have it, financial champions. We've just unlocked the secrets to mastering your money like true wizards. Quick recap, know where your treasure comes from, build a magical emergency fund, conquer those student loan dragons, let your money grow with investing spells, and set sail for a prosperous retirement. Now, here's the magic part, take action. Implement these tips and watch your financial adventure unfold. But wait, we want to hear from you. What tips do you have? Any money-saving spells you'd like to share? Drop them in the comments below, and let's build a community of financial wizards helping each other out. A massive thank you for joining us on this enchanted journey. If you haven't already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button, like the video, and share it with your fellow adventurers. Until next time, stay financially fabulous, and may your pockets be forever.